Whitseth assisted the Crosby Ironton School District in passing a referendum in 2019. Improvements to both the elementary and secondary buildings are planned over several phases. The focus during phase two at the secondary school was a revitalization of the career and technical education area. It's the 21st century. We live in a fast and changing world. Our world is changing every day. How do we prepare our students for these high pay, high demand jobs that are out there? That's what we asked ourselves. We asked our community, we asked our stakeholders. Their response was to build this $3.6 million CTE facility. The school board and staff recognized the importance of workforce development and awareness and invited community partners to be a part of the design process. Throughout the project, Woodseth listened and gained an understanding of the district's needs, all the while noting the insights from the community partners' experience, which included representatives from Magnum Machining, Graphic Packaging, and Central Lakes College. We thought it was a great opportunity to get into the schools and guide and introduce kids to manufacturing at a, a younger age than the, that they would. And then throughout the whole process, they were very good at asking us what, what we thought as manufacturing partners or what Magnum thought, giving them you know, direction for the future for where I saw they wanted to go. It was, it was really great to work with them. If you look at the Ranger Made program, what they're doing, the kids are able to see you know, a whole spectrum of manufacturing rather than just thinking you know, it's, it's a drill press here or welding or woodworking. Um, so it really gives them a very wide range of, I guess, the industry itself. Whitseth incorporated this information in various ways, from opening up interior and exterior walls for students and the community to see what happens in these spaces, as well as assist staff with being able to visually see multiple spaces at one time to laying out equipment to provide efficiencies with the flow of materials in and product out, all the while keeping the importance of safety first and foremost. It truly will be exciting to see where the students take this Ranger Made program. Well, CLC wants to support all the local schools around us. When high schools introduce an interest in welding, that is a direct benefit to my program. I think some of the tech ed trades are frowned upon a little bit in the world nowadays. The ability to see that they're not grungy, dirty shops, they're clean, state-of-the-art, air-conditioned, heated. There's a lot more to it than maybe what has been portrayed in the past. You know, the instructors now have a great opportunity ahead of them to redesign how they teach and, and what they teach. You know, bring some good employees to the workforce. When this came up, when we saw, you know, it, it benefits kids, you know, hopefully it'll benefit us, you know, down the road, keeping kids local, getting them in manufacturing. Um, so what we did, we did a $25,000 donation this year to help them get things up and going. Um, and then we committed to five years, $5,000 each year after that. So the total donation was 50 grand over the five years. You know, if I was a kid, I would, or a student, I would be down here as much as possible. You know, everything from 3D printing to be able to go on a, you know, state-of-the-art CNC horizontal machining center. Uh, the woodworking, it's, it's robotics, it's, it's really great to see. Every time we give a tour, whether it's to students, to staff, to our public, to community members, we always get the same response. People are amazed by the state-of-the-art facility. When you work with Woodseth, here's what we know is going to happen. It's just much more than a room. They're going to make a room that's going to perform. And there's no other space that I can think of in a high school that is going to need more uh, gadgetry, uh, more infrastructure behind the walls, above the ceilings, below the floors than a CTE wing. And Woodseth, through everything that they had, every resource that they had at this project, and you can see it has exceeded our, all of our expectations.